We caught up with a few Bowdoin students at the bus stop and the train station to ask them about their spring break travel plans. Where are you going today and how are you getting there? I'm going to Paris, France, and I'm taking the bus to Portland and then to Boston and flying from Boston to Charles de Gaulle Airport in France. Today I'm going to Ithaca, so Bowdoin is not that hard to get to, but Ithaca is actually. Typically I just take the Concorde to uh, Boston Logan Airport and then take a direct flight to Seattle. and. Yeah, it works well for me. I mean, we're definitely not in the middle of nowhere, as some people like to think. <laughs> it's only two hours from here to Boston, and it's cheap and efficient. <laughs> I knew that there was going to be a train here, so I guess that's one of the benefits. I knew that it was going to be easier to get around to where I want to go. My sister works in uh, Boston, and just recently she came up just to visit me for the day. It's kind of proof that it's, it's not very hard to get up here. I'm going home, so I'm going to Wyoming. It's incredibly easy to get in and out of Portland, which makes it easy to get in and out of Brunswick as well. And do you like taking the train? Usually there's a lot of Bowdoin students on the train, so you can catch up with people or talk to people who you haven't seen during finals or midterms. I actually went back to my high school a couple years ago and someone asked me what it was like to go to school in a rural campus and I was like, well, we're not really rural, we're actually suburban, we're in a really nice town, we're like half an hour, 20 minutes from a major city with an airport. I like want to travel somewhere, there's so many like options available for me to take transportation to different places like on a regular schedule. Plane, train, and automobile? Yes, and bike sometimes. <laughs>